Eko dede a siko yi. Bubwe yi nyo wa nino ili. I greet everyone. Before we start our program tonight, I would like to use this opportunity to thank everyone who have congratulated me on my new um, appointment. So may Almighty God continue to be uh, with you all. Uh, our topic for today, uh, we shall discuss about uh, 5,000 names and the meaning uh, I want to call in Kota Pesoro ni Luri La Pesoro ni Luri Leni as I promised that we shall bring this topic uh, some people requested from me that I should mix up this program with Yoruba uh, that we are have to think that some of them so may not understand uh, what we are saying in English so and I told them that they should remember that most of uh, our viewers uh, they are non Yorubas uh, so uh, inshallah I will try to mix up so Yoruba English so and some other uh, uh, language so so that Everyone we uh, benefit from this our program. Uh, this our program is just for learning purpose. So as I always say, we are not here to attack anybody. So we are here to uh, to educate ourselves. So um, having a baby is a, a, a joyous joyous time for every one at home for every parent to have a baby, to have uh, a newborn baby. Uh, one of the best things for the parents, so at home after uh, the bath, so is to uh, give them their baby uh, or child a righteous, righteous name, so with a good meaning. Uh, it is common understanding among the Muslims. So, uh, they have uh, four categories uh, of giving their children names. So, some of them pick up their names from uh, 99 beautiful uh, names of Almighty Allah. So, which we shall discuss. So, if time permitted us, so... I will bring all the 99 names of Almighty Allah in English and in Yoruba. So, uh, some of the Muslim they they decide uh, uh, to pick um, names sometimes from the Prophet's uh, names because Prophet Muhammad also have about two, 201 names. So, and some uh, prefer to, to pick some from 99 names of Allah because uh, it was reported that Prophet Muhammad said the most beloved of names uh, to Allah so are uh, that 99 names of Allah so uh, and Prophet Muhammad said the best among these names uh, so are uh, Abdullah, Abdurrahman so narrated by Muslim so in his uh, hadith uh, some they prefer that uh, when a child is born, so they said, okay, Ejeka Murukowa from the names of the prophet, prophet of Almighty God. Some they prefer to, to pick up the uh, uh, name from from Bible as well. So because the Bible also mentioned uh, uh, names of the prophets. So and some they 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 prefer to. To, to pick up the name of their child from uh, names of angel, so, so names of angel. Some, 
uh, names of uh, Sahaba, the disciple, disciple of Prophet Muhammad, or disciple of uh, uh, Jesus. So uh, some they 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 take uh, from the notable uh, jurists. So some they pick they pick from uh, from scholars. So from scholars' name. So choosing the name is the right of a uh, father. So because he is one after whom uh, the child will be uh, recognized. So. Uh, but it is uh, mustahabu. Mustahabu is uh, highly recommended for the father, so to involve the mother. So, so the father must involve the mother of the baby. So, uh, to seek her opinion. So, to seek her opinion, it is very very uh, important. So, uh, the child must be named after their father. Uh, even if the father is is deceased or or, or or divorced, so if the child is born outside of wedlock, so um, if this happen, so the child should be named so after their mother. So these are some of the Islamic etiquettes. So we must know when naming our our children. So who have uh, so. Um, uh, because some they have it in their mind that when uh, 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 when their baby is born, so some they have special name because maybe because how the name uh, it, it sound so all the name is melody so without knowing the the meaning of the name it is very very dangerous for us to name our child without knowing the meaning of of the name. So uh, I have with me more than uh, 4,000 names that I will uh, bring on this program. So it's going to be bit by bit because, you know, we can't finish everything that I go. So uh, then, uh, inshallah, I will try my possible best to mix up this program with Yoruba uh, as uh, our viewers uh, requested. So... Ah, uh, utafe soro la le yi ta sta gbe wa le ni ohun na ni nipa oruko oruko o se pataki pupo ni awujo oruko uh, we have to keep our name so like be a won stingy awon ahun bo se ma ntojo ohun ni won be la gboro tojo oruko wa nitori pe so if ti oruko ba ti le baje ko se tu se mo so oruko o se pataki pupo ni awujo oruko o ju owo lo opolopo idile lo wa ti won ni oruko to ya si pe awon omo won ti won de later awon na ba oruko idile na je so awon mi wa to ya si pe nitori owo nitori ile nitori aso nitori dukia won ba oruko ara won je they involve themselves in fraud in anything because they are looking for money. So, and when your name is thin, so there is no remedy. So, you have to be very, very careful to keep your name saved. So, against fraud or against anything. So, I uh, uh, were very, very careful. So, this topic that I saw, little yi pataki pupo. See about Bioma when a child is born and you invite uh, Ulama, the scholars, to name your child, you have to ask them to tell you the meaning of the name they are giving to your child. So to re upolo pa wa fa me wa to wa ma itu ma uruko to fe fun a wa ma. So a wa me wa a wa ma force a wa fa e kwe uruko buy ni a wa fe so one de no ma so uruko a ma ye. So, uh, oh, are very, very dangerous. So we we can see in the in the uh, Holy Bible. So, uh, Prophet Abraham also was named Abraham, but uh, Almighty God changed Abraham to Abraham. So Abraham A B uh, Abraham. So they change it to Abraham to A B uh, R A H A M. And they changed Sarai to Sarah. 
So all this only reason and they change Jacob to Israel. So only reason. So if you your name, uh, if Tobari pe oru koto nje, so it doesn't carry a positive meaning. So you have right to change it before it is too late. You have right to change your name because if the meaning doesn't carry a positive uh, meaning because the bearer of names, uh, the meaning of the name follows the, the bearer. So, all oh, are very, very important. So, as I said, so when a baby is born, so uh, his, uh, his, his parents will be eager to name him or her a special, a special name. So, but many people bear name they cannot explain uh, the meaning of the name. So some give uh, names to their uh, children because of the melody, as I said, or how it sounds. So many of the uh, uh, name follows the bearer, as I said. So I am here today, so on this program, to inform you uh, about uh, 5,000 names. So uh, its origin, so as well, so and then the meaning. So welcome to uh, Noral Hack. So each country around the world, they named their children as a result of uh, uh, some situation. So some Muslims, they follow some designed names compiled by uh, their religious uh, leaders. So without knowing the meaning. So some Christians as well, they pick uh, some names from the Bible without knowing the meaning. So in Genesis, Genesis 17 to 5, so God changed Abraham to Abraham, as I said. So he changed Saul, Saul to Paul. So in Acts 13 to 9, so he changed Jacob to Israel. In Genesis 32, verse 28, uh, then Genesis 35, verse 10, he changed Sarai to Sarah. So Sarai, uh, when a Muslim queen, is Sarata. So, uh, then he changed Simon to Peter. So, uh, in Genesis 17, verse uh, 15, Prophet Muhammad also changed uh, many names of uh, of of some of uh, his companions, and he changed many names, bad many bad names of city, so to good one. So, uh, Prophet Muhammad changed uh, um, uh, somebody when they brought him to Prophet Muhammad and asked him about his name, and he said, "My name is Bagidu." So Prophet Muhammad changed it to Habib. So Habib is beloved one. So, so Bagid is hatred one. So Prophet Muhammad changed it. Then he asked another person, uh, and that person said her name is Murra. So Murra, so only koto kuru, so bitter. So then Prophet Muhammad changed it to Faraha. So o change it see, uh, you don't know. So something good. So uh, and uh, that was a, a guy. So, Tobe Ruru Kwe Oluru Oko Unje Abdulasa Eru Osha Osha Kanan Kwen Lasa So, Lata So, Prophet Muhammad Chenje O Chenje Oluru Kwe Niyesi Abdulai So, uh, this program We assist you To know many of name That brings uh, Positive So, results And joy to the To the bearer so, Nino Suratul Hujirat, verse 11, Olong Soikwe, Oni Wala Tana Bazu, Bili Ale Kobi, Bisali Ismuli Fusuku, Badal Imani, Waman Lami Yatupfa Ula Ika, Homo the Limon, Oni, and do not defame, do not defame one another. Emma Barain Lur Koche. Do not defame one another. So by using bad names. So how bad 
uh, it is after having um, after having truth uh, faith. So only a person does uh, does act. So but does not turn in repentance. That it does not repent. So only to Almighty God. Only so then surely they are the oppressors. So in this verse, so Almighty Allah is giving us advice that we should uh, not defame our name. We should keep our name as 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 we are keeping our our valuable things. So so that is how we should keep our name clean. So Islam forbids bad names. So nothing wrong having a good nickname, but stay away from uh, hateful. Uh, Nick names, so it is not uh, good at all. Uh, then uh, it is forbidden. It is very, very forbidden uh, in Islam as well, making fun of people or defaming ourselves because of money, because of uh, a position, because of any this uh, anything. Uh, so, so like So this is very, very bad. So we have to keep our name clean. Then calling people by offensive uh, or, 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 or or pleasant uh, names, so nicknames. So this is very, very bad. So we have to stay away from anything uh, offensive uh, nickname. So then. Um, as I said, I have with me here many uh, biblical names and also some Quranic uh, names, so which I will give details. So uh, this is just an uh, intro. So then we shall discuss about uh, naming rights, uh, naming rights uh, in Christianity and also Islamic rulings, so for newborn babies. So every child is mortgaged. Uh, with uh, its akeka, so which is to be slaughtered uh, an animal, so on its seventh day, so on that day, so he or she must be named, so and shaved, so taba bioma lati fa inorie, ati lati soni oruko kade kwa ira suna, so. Uh, taba bi omo ni ojo Thursday she Thursday to tell ila ma so mo yoruko ni abi Wednesday so ambo ha lori e if a baby was born for you on Thursday which day will you be uh will you be will be uh, the name ceremony so we shall come to that so uh, Wednesday or Thursday so akika is the islamic tradition of sacrifice of an animal so on the occasion for child's uh, bath. So it is widely performed so by Muslims and considered as a sunnah. So to slaughter a sheep so for the uh, baby and distribute the meat uh, to the poor. So two sheep for a boy and uh, uh, one sheep for, for female. So uh, why two uh, sheep for a boy? And one sheep for a girl. So I will explain this later. Uh, then, uh, can we perform a kiko after the seven days? So, after the seven days of a kiko, so can we perform the a kiko? So, uh, why uh, a kiko is an Arabic word? So, from uh, a verb, aka uh, yaoku, so a kikatan. So, uh, means uh, cutting, cuts that is cutting because cutting of the uh, child's uh, uh, because we have to unlatify in Rurie, so that is why it's often when a cake because of the child's heads. So, uh, Tama cut in Rurie, uh, so uh, that is uh, the shaving, that is what we mean by that is to, to shave. Uh, his head or head on the seventh day. So, so proceeding uh, birth. So, uh, why we must engage in a kicker? So, what are the reasons behind this? Then, 
what are the supplications? So our prayer to Allah to she could do the some more Then whose responsibility is a kicker if the father is not capable? So uh, then the responsibility will be on the mother. So if neither is capable, so then it so it's no longer remain. Uh, Yes, it's no longer remain incumbent. So, that is, there is no necessity to take a loan in order to fulfill the responsibility of a kicker. So, Krishi Dedan Kolo Yawu, Professor Maluruko, Alati Logic Bese, Alati Washo, to be married, Lati Gafel Ko, Majade, and one Logic Bese, and one Kurans Wahala to Professor Somaluruko. So this is not uh, this is not good. So then uh, I will inform you about the uh, the few misconception. So we have many misconception uh, on Akika. So a few innovation that is bidia. So it is commonly believed that the parents, uh, the paterna and the maternal grandparents cannot consume the meat. The meat of Akika. I mean, so by only I want to be a be baba baba. I want to be a man. I need to come here sooner. So, kiss your own. I can't jam be a bottle of one. So, one if one be so we will lay. It's just a, uh, it's a false innovation. So, kiss your own. To to la la fear. Then why Muslims recite Adhan? Tomba be a man. Tomba be a man. Eti was a karma. See let you see why. So Masha Laye Bubwa Kene ye uh then Tahanik uh Taba be on my supplication and also to place a little of honey uh honey uh in the newborn baby's mouth. So why? So then circumcision. So why uh why circumcision? So, what age uh, should circumcision be uh, be carried out? That is a uh, light color for money. It so she or I and the car baby or my car color for so because I have to explain all this before we now move into names and the meaning. There are some uh, 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 there are some process. So, before to go to the pair, so my little call. So, I have to explain all this before we now move into uh, how. Uh, to name our uh, our newborn baby, so ah, are you want had this solution? Really, she told you about this here. Uh, what can fabricate any? So, is she a one? This is he, oh, less to less and less. Uh, are you this can let all the jabiru? Uh, una at the abu rera now. More had this here. What anas? Uh, they said, uh, that Prophet Muhammad said that. When a child is born, so bear that bear my name. That Prophet Muhammad said that uh, you have to name your child his name. So, but do not use my kunia. That Prophet Muhammad said that you should not use his nickname. His nickname is Rasul. So this hadith is false. It's fabric. Is is fabricated hadith. So Prophet Muhammad never said this. So because we uh, we have seen that uh, he himself had. Uh, uh, seven children, so you never name any of uh, his children his name. So, uh, one name, Professor Akwe, I am Muhammad. So, uh, that is, I am Muhammad, I am uh, Mahi, so I am Hashir, so I'm Akib. So, Wawa Hadisi, Kishi Hadisi, Tio Lesele. So, one name, Professor Akwe, the Babi, or my daughter, Sonny Muhammad, or my wife, Jenna. I my Muhammad to buy, I my Muhammad to buy less and to a barrel long. So I generally know in one war. So by her, this he she at this city, oh, less and less. So, um, you know, I want to tell you more for a So when the uh, when the uh, this uh, hakiko should be performed, so what are the reason behind the naming, as I said, so, um. Then supplication uh, at the time of uh, sacrifice. So whose responsibility is a kicker? 
So uh, if the father is not capable, but he she alayele if he wa gagabi moseso. Now, uh, our Yoruba, in Yoruba land, they have a special way of naming their children. So, um, in Yoruba land, Yoruba, they, they have uh, names, uh, these names are traditional classified into five uh, categories. So, when I would call uh, to work when you are a little bit of a little bit so church as like a bike, a biomacosoni, a bike, a biomacosoni, a nike, a biomacosoni, a lao, a biomacosoni, a jao, a shabi, a moque, a ila, a jaque. So, Buba Uru Koi, they are just. Uh, Panegyric's uh, uh, name, so be Oriki. So then Yoruba, they have another one called Abiso. Oruko Abiso. These are the acquired uh, names, so granted by grandparents when a child is born. So in the family, like Kansomani uh, Adironke, Turayo, so Oma 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 Bola, so Oma Lola, Moreni Keji. Uh, for la we yo uh udutola so omalola are yo so uba uru koi u lankwe nikini abiso ni ra uru koi le yi that is acquired uh names so granted by the uh the grandparents then in Yoruba land as well they have something we call uh uruko abatonwa that is destiny names uh, uh, such as like Taye, uh, Kainde, these are, they give this name to uh, twins. When uh, the first child, so uh, one name is Taye, Taye is the Taiwo, you know, Taye Wo, not so the Taiwo. So the Bible is short, like Taye, that is Taye. So, but what is your wokuro? That's all to aye wo. The first person to call to aye wo. No man name ye ni taye. Then the second one, so we be kain de. That is it be all kain ko to de, ko to be si aye. So, these are the meaning of taye and kain de. So, uh, these are the, then, ti o bere ye batun lo yun, to batun bi o man, aida o koni ni abo bere. So, they will now <coughs> name that the full, the follow child um idowu so that is the third so to follow twins then ti o bere ba tu bi mo to ba tun to ba tun bi o mo wa tun so yen kini alaba so that is taye kainde idowu alaba to ba tun bi o mo again wa so ni idogbe idogbe so then elomi ti iya e ba se ku Ti yawe ba wa bi oma, so wa kwe ni ye tu de, to ba jow beri, to ba jow kwenye wa so ni baba tu de. So, then ojo, so ige, ajayi, dada, bubu awa kini, lo ni rizi, tu wan fin, kini, tu lo de tu wan so awa mani ige, aso yi tu me fwa. Then, why ojo, aso tu me, mini of ajayi, mini of ige, mini of ojo, so, I will explain all this. Later, then uh, the fourth the fourth one only oruko inagije. That is uh, what we both call uh, alias, alias. So uh, such as kope omani omalewa, awelewa. So ajidara, so ajishafe, so arewa, so awo yoruba, wama saba so. Ira wan uruko ba yi. Number five. Uh, Yoruba also they name their, uh, ch their child or their children. So, uh, ni a uruko kantankwe ni uruko a, a, a biku. A biku. So, such as uh, kokuma. So, tomba bi oma tomba yen banku. Tomba banku. Wanwa soni uruko kantankwe yi oma yen. 
o ma wa ste ko ni kumo so to ba ti pe ko kumo ko kumo e ri pe awon omo yen lo ni kun to to so that's their belief o de nsele abi kan so ni bi o ba ku gbogbo en ta ba gbo tin je bi o ba ku iya won iya won se abi amo ti awon omo yen ku lo je kan pe ni ni bi o ba ku da si pe ti le o ba ku yo mo wa pelu awon abi kan so ni ma lo mo so ma lo mo ni pe don't go again so don't die so stay with us so na ni ma lo mo so abi kan so ni duro jaye so stay with us so ko le enjoy ile aye abi kan so ni kashi ma wo so bi abiola nisin iya re bi awon mo to ku to po ko to di pe ohun wa duro so won wa so ohun ni kashi ma wo kashi ma wo boye leyin o ni ku so ko de ku na olodun de ni ko ye so ko to di pe o o o jade ko laye ah abi kan so mo ni duro sin lohun awon muslim ton ba bi omo ti o ba ye si pe omo yen ku pupo won ma so ni duro sin lohun ko duro lati ba won sin olohun o de ma duro ko ni ku mo abi kan so mo ni ko soko eh itumo ko soko ni pe there is no ho ko si oko ta won ma fi gbe ile ah ta won ma fi sin omo yen si so ko soko mo o that is ko si oko won mo ye o gbodo ku o so and omo yen de ma duro ko ni ku so yoruba uh, also they have a traditional name such as uh, ifagbe mi awo lowo so awo lowo so is a traditional name uh, awo oni owo te gboro bowo fun awon alawo na ni tumo awo lowo so ifagbe mi so ifa ogbe mi awon ton jade lati idile oni fa so fadiya so uh, that is awon o di lo ni fa na ni pe ifa lo di iya ti awon nje so ogun dele ogun mola awon ton wa lati dile ologun to tin bo ogun ogun gbe mi so as i said what is the meaning of ojo ojo is a male child who has who has a umbilical cord so umbilical cord so so tied around his neck so when he was born so o lo je ko mo pe ni ojo so kini ti o ma ba to ma to ma supo ma idudu omo kini mo iya ko wa ko gbe mo lorun ro omo be ti awon yoruba ba ti bi won loruko mi tan fe pe ju ojo so ojo lo ah then ige so ige ah it ige ni pe a boy or a baby who came out of the womb with feet first so to ma he bi omo to wa pe ta pe ori lo mo ma mu wa sai won wa ri pe ese lo mo ye kokotis waju so iru omo bayi ni wa ma pe ni ige to ba je okunrin to ba je obirin won pe ni kini aina so if your name is aina so by this time so now i'm giving you the the meaning and why you named or why your parents named you aina if your name is ojo so you must know the meaning of ojo today that when you were born so you came with umbilical cord so tied on your neck so uh then dada so dada i want ni children with a knotted ear so we pe awon to ta koko ta koko bayi to ma to ma wa lori won so now awon mo to ba ti bi bayi so any kan to need the cause se ronu pe oruko wo ni awon fe so that is go ti gbe oruko yen wa lati orun so as i said awon ta e kan ina won ti gbe oruko won wa lati orun so alaba o ti mo oruko e wa lati orun so idowu o ti mo oruko e wa lati orun so won ani di kan se ma ronu Uruko ta fe so uh, this is a uh, part of the tradition in Yoruba land so when it comes to uh, naming uh, the baby so uh then uh, Yoruba places high volume so or high value on names so they strongly believe that the meaning of any name follows the bearer so Yoruba also believe this 
that the meaning of any name follows the bearer. Oruko amatele omenia amatele ni. Uh, in Yoruba as well, Aotobawa from real family. If you are from Yoruba from real family, so Uni Aoruko tema magbo tuma so ikwe ade wale ade yeye so ade ronke ade sonya ade yonju so ade wumi ade shanu so uh, so that kale ma ikwe idile idile totiwa so idile ade ni they are from real family when you hear any name start with ade just believe that that person is from real family so gbo awon oruko bayi ni alati mo idi pataki ti won se nje be i will tell you uh, the meaning of ilori so oke okay, eta oko so uh, ni igba ti a ba nte si waju uh, orisirisi awon oruko ni ni uh, ni atiri ti awon eyan je to ya si pe they want to know uh the mini so then why it i want je iru awon oruko yi uh gbogbo awon kan ti aso yi o wa ninu eto ti o wa ninu ede uh awon uh ede ti awon yoruba fin so omo loruko uh as i said that uh awon kan they believe that uh ti awon ba bi omo so they have to name that child so come and pick your look from the prophets so from prophets of almighty god so uh we have uh, about 25 prophets mentioned in the holy quran and we have more than 48 names in the bible as well so even including female so there are some female that they regard them uh, as prophetesses so uh mashi alai lori eleyi na then uh kini ituma awon oruko awon prophet yi kini ituma awon oruko awon prophet yi uh ma so ituma oruko eniko kan fun wa ninu eto yi uh a so mini kini je adam kini ituma abraham kini tuma noha kini tuma david kini tuma job kini tuma solomon so kini tuma uh, elisha kini tuma elijah so gbogbo awon kini yi ni a ma se alaye fun wa awon wo la n pe ni sahaba so ta n pe ni sahabe awon wo na nje be so uh, then uh, I want one uh, like you know, the one prophet. So Bible also mentioned many of the prophets like uh, Jeremiah. Bible mentioned about uh, Ezekiel. Bible mentioned about is uh, Abraham. It mentioned about Noah. So there are major and minor prophets in the Bible. So uh, who is prophet in the Bible? So. Kini on how can can we define a prophet? So prophet is an uh, individual, individual who is regarded as being in contact with a divine mission with God. So through the angel. So delivering the message for teaching, uh, to uh, teaching morals. So awele uh, ini ampeni prophet. So, uh, 40 prophets were mentioned in the Bible. So, some say they are 48. So, Bible mentioned, uh, uh, mentioned about seven women. So, regarded them as a prophetess. As I said, Bible mentioned uh, Esther. Uh, Bible mentioned Hannah. Bible mentioned Abigail. Bible mentioned Deborah. The Bible mentioned uh, Mary and then Sarah and Hulida. So, we go to our Tawi, we go to Ujishe Niwa, to our Jay Ujishe alone. 
ti won wa je obinrin so ti won je obinrin pe ojise olohun ni won but ninu quran as well so ari awon evidences ninu quran so to soro nipa awon awon anabi olohun awon prophet so prophets o yato si messenger there is a difference between the prophet and the messenger of almighty god so mashallah ye fun wa ti awon arab ton ba so ri pe anabi yu ta ni won pe be so anabi yu huwa insanun insanu yatalaqqa li wahya so min allah ta'ala imma bi wasitati ru'ya al manamiya aw bi wasitati ilhamin so you li kihi li malaikatu fi qoli bihi yaksotan au bi wasitoti samai kalami lahi bila wasitotin wala tarijuman. So anabi olon wenta lekpe ni anabi. Onyo me ni yakan tongba revelation la to do olon. So either toba sun oman lala ama receive message la to do olon. Adiko shekpe ko sun okan joko. Abori lo ki an malaika kon ma ju kan si ninu emi pe nkan ba yo sele to de ba to ba le ti so pe yo sele a de sele n toto abi ki o ma gbo ohun olohun fun rara re gege bi mose o ni oke to ma lo joko to de ma gbo ohun olohun olohun o ran jibrilu pe koya lo so fun so ari this is a definition ta le fun anabi and anabi is an arabic word so on to ma en ton fun wa ni iro ikoko so en ton fun o meyan ni iro ikoko nkan ta mo so on sin ko ma fun wa ni nkan to fe sele so e de arabic ni so na ni on an yoruba na ma pe ni anabi so anabi is anabi you so arabic na se ni won so so awon bible awon christian ma so pe wo li so a muslim so e pe anabi olohun so uh, then uh, e eh, wa ri melo ni gbogbo won uh, awon wa wa adadul anbiyahi so kathirun so on ka won po gan ni but ninu hadith a gbo ninu awon oro ti prophet so yi pe o ngba ti won bi pe melo ni gbogbo awon anabi olohun gbogbo prophet so they, he said the are uh, 124000 ni gbugbun apatapata so ninu awon 124000 yi so awon 313 ninu won olohun wa iyo won segbe kan as ojise so that is we have 313 messengers of almighty god from 124000 prophets so all the uh all the uh messengers are prophets but not all the prophets uh are messengers so that is see pe awon prophets ki se gbogbo won ni won je ojise ti olohun ran won si awon eyin awon eyin abi ilu kan so uh eri ton ba pe ni ojise olohun olohun ma fun ni agbara kan ton pe ni mujiza uh nkan imo to ma se ti enikan le mu iru ewa so ti o fi ti o ti awon yo fi believe pe lo to ojise olohun ni so ninu awon ojise olohun awon marun to won wa most powerful ju ninu gbogbo won awon marun ni won uh noha uh, ati abraham so ati mose ati jesus ati muhammad awon mararun yi uh awon ni won ni won wa ni ipo to gaju to ri pe won fe si opolopo wahala ni aye so won de fe si opolopo fitina nigbati won wa ni aye so o je ki won ka won pe okay won je awon ojise nla iye awon ti a wi yi muslim scholars so uh, the the debated of uh, prophet hood of uh, among the women so so some they believe that ipe olohun oyan obirin kankan ni ojise olohun 
awon kan wa ni ah ba o le se le so beyen to ba ye si pe ba o la se le define ojise abi anabi anabi olohun le nto ri malaika abi ti malaika ba soro so miriam mary the mother of jesus so angel appeared to her and angel spoke to her when jesus was born so a je pe miriam ojise olohun ni ohun na so won debate se leyi and the mother of moses as well won debate oro te na pe ojise olohun ni then habila so also was regarded as a first prophet so in the bible after adam and quran mentioned about habila as well that is a uh, uh, abel so quran mentioned about abel and cain that's habila and kabila so and also quran mentioned how habila was was murdered by his brother so that is a uh, kabila so and then uh who is uh, amos so bible mentioned about amos he mentioned about daniel he mentioned about david so then uh he mentioned about elijah at elisha he mentioned about joseph he mentioned about solomon bible mentioned jeremiah he mentioned jesus so uh we shall discuss this in full then he mentioned about john as well and he mentioned about uh, jonah and then uh who was the last prophet so of the old testament so we shall discuss about this then who is uh, nahura so who is uh, saul who is simon so who is banaba so gbogbo awon nkan bayi ni a o discuss ki o le ba ye wa um then awon wo ni malaika who are the angel so al malaika uh, awon ni ariwa hun makalu cotton min nurin awon edakan ni ti olohun da latara imole latara imole lolohun ti da awon malaika eh la yakuluna wala yashrabuna won kin je so won kin mu so uh, wala yanamun won kin sun so won kin sun uh, kutu hum onje won ohun ni kini atesibe gugu ana man se afomo olohun ogo ni fun olohun ogo ni fun eledumare orin ni orin na man fi yin olohun ni bi tun wa so and wa hum mawjudu na fi kulli makan gugu bi kibi ni awon malaika wa ba pa julo awon eleisin awon bi to ba clean awon angel ma wa nbe so uh, a wala hum ashikalu mukhtalifa so many hum uh, a money who are ala shakli insani malaika mi wa to pe o da bi eyan so malaika mi wa to ya si pe o da gege bi eye emi wa o da gege bi ejo emi wa o da gege bi uh, o da gege bi bi e kojo eyan kojo kojo eye so won ma wa ni inu odo won ma wa ninu papa won ma wa kakiri won wa nsomo won wa ni ori ile iyan awon malaika so won kin se olohun gbogbo nkan tolohun ba ni ki won se ni awon ma nse awo menian we have free will angel they don't have they doesn't have no angel to ni um free will so they do, so they, they follow the order from god so tolo ba tin kan se nkan ma nse so oruko awon malaika o po so bo lara won uh, jibril so jibril yi ni quran pe but bible biblical uh, name for jibril is what is gabriel so it's the same so gabriel o na ni jibril so ohun le ni ti o mu revelation wa fun agbo awon anabi olohun pata atan ojise ah uh, yen uh, jibril then okan to wa tan pe ni mikail ohun na pe ni michael so mikail ni arabic ni oda muslimi so mike michael lo da on christian so wa huwa alladhi yaksimu al-amtara ohun lo wa ni diojo to lo ni ko ma pe ojo ibi to ba fe ko ro ojo si ati ategun ati gbogbo nkan ti awomi niyan wa kakiri 
Then, he got to a tongue when he's Raphael, or not when he's Raphael. Near the tea, Christ, uh, Christianity, our Muslim, I also equate is Raphael. So, only one when Raphael, or no more fun theory. Ni timba ti olon ba fè gbe bwa dide fwen yi da jon ta ba she la ye. O bwa buru to she la ye. O fri o osa kante. Bo bo re re to she. O fri osa kante. So yon ti o wali jena. So o le wali jena fri. O la wan she to ba she. Wan to ba fè wana o le wana fri. A wan she a buru to ba she na ma fi. Ma e wolo ma a ye wolo ma a wani nou e nan. Ta ra wan inje yi. O wana o kato atan kwenye azra yi lo. Azrailu huwa ledi ya kipidu li ariwaha kula hawa lo mangba bu buwemi. Bu buwemi pata atenyaw atawen roko unu lo mba yemi wan. Awa kani rara unu kolo mba yemi awen roko awa landu wan. Abi ito ba kufre. So idai di waluri nye. Suban unu lo wani nchaji emi. Ika watan tunpe ni atidu. Atidu huwa ledi ya kutubu seye ati li kuli insan. Bo bwa buto ba shen, ma lai ka kan wa ni o wwa tun re, tin kobo bwe si le. O nan kpe ni, ke ni, o nan kpe ni, a ti du. E kan wa wa ni o wwa o tun re, right side, o wwa ni ro kip, o wwa lon kobo bo, bo bo, da da to ba shen, o bo yon lo wo ni, o shi da da ni, o o, o, o soro, do do dan bi kan ni, a, e yon so kon wa ba yon, o, 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 do ni nou, so, wwa kobo bwe si le. So, E yi ton shè yen wang pe ni kini rokib. I kan an me ji kan an atan pe ni moun karo wang na kiro. So, a huma al malakani al ladhani yes alani kula insani. So, an robbi hi wadini hi ina yadkhul maut, kabra, bada al maut. An malaka me yi ji, an wang ni wang ma biyome ni yan. Un ba tome yan ba kouti wang ti diyobay, ti wang biyos nou sa re. Bubu wa pata pata la kube. So, taba wa debe. Awa malaka meji to ma yosi wa. To ma beri question. You will be questioned. To ma beri. Ki lo shilai. Wani beri moto. Wani beri ile. Wani beri ashoto ra. Wani beri ya moto bi. No. Ki ni. Bubu nto ni la ye. Ki lo li. Ki lo li. To karere wulu fi she. So. Aha. Awa malaka meji. Awa ndo de wa. Ninu sa re. Ikotu mbe to nje ridiwan. So, ou ni malaika ti owa ni in charge paradise. Ou ni the chief security to owa ni paradise. So, ikotu mbe to nje ridiwan. Maliku, maliku ou ni malaika ti owa fi si in charge ili ina. So, ou lo wa ni in charge ili ina. So, ti uba anti owa wwa ina. Ou ni owa gbe anwe to ili lo wwa. The reason why I'm bringing all this is because we have some people that they name their child Gabriel. So what is the meaning of Gabriel? So some they name their child Raphael. So I want me so Mawani Mikael. So Mikael, you know, so the Mukaila. Nick Batu on Bamakwe. So Mikael, only a Bible mark when you Michael. So what on je Michael at what on je Mukaila abi Mikaelu ika kana ni oruko ni oruko malaika lenge. So ah wala ni kato somare ni Azrailu ito ngai mi. So ari ato nje Ridwan. So Ridwan ito maya da yonu. So am moshimbo wasi bi awo ito mau but moko konso awo boni awo oruko ito mbo. So Then, can you reason it? Yeah, when you see the man, so I won't look at you. So, I'm going to let you go to the house. I'm going to let you go to the house. I'm going to let you go to the house. As I said, you have right to change your name if it has a negative meaning. So, because some people name their child a wrong name. So some they they they, they name their child uh, we uh, name which is a uh, old Irish Irish name. Now I mean so many what you want them to be. Ilu Irish ni on so many little kobe. For instance, now if your name is Linda, Linda means serpent, a joke. 
Is that a good name? To be a Linda. So Linda uh, is, is, uh, is uh, uh, the origin of Linda is from Germany. So it's Germany language. So Toba Maya, Toba Lat Germany, Wabri, Lower Pekini to my Linda, Toba Nima, Yosof, a Jew. Nanny to my Linda. So, which is very, very bad. So, uh, then, Ki Eoma Jam Maria. Maria, uh, which is old Irish name, also which means bitterness. Ibanuje? So how could you name your, your child bitterness? This is very sad. So because you don't know the meaning, you have to know the meaning. That is why I'm here for you today. So Linda, uh, which means serpent in, in Germany, uh, German language. Then Awausa in the northern part in Nigeria, some Hausa they name their child Lami. Lami in Hausa. Uh, which is Thursday. So, you know, these Arab people, uh, the Arab, they have, uh, they have a uh, name of uh, of the week and they have name of the month. So, in the Arabic, so Monday is Yomul uh, Yomul is name. So Sunday is Yomul Ahad. Uh, so Yomul Ahad ni Sunday. So Yomul is named in the Monday. Yomul Sulasa in Tuesday. So Yomul Arbeya in the Wednesday. Then Yomul Khamis on the Thursday. Then Yomul Juma in the Friday. So Yomul Sabti in the Saturday. Then Yomul Had uh, Sunday. So now, Owa Bioma. So you now name your child name of the week. So so Al Khamis on the one shot. They shorten. Uh, al khamis to lami so am a pomoni lami so lami means a child born on thursday awon mi wa so ni danjuma so a child so ti to won be ni jo friday because you only juma so juma so omo jo jima no so the danjuma so, uh, oh, oh, sad, oh, sad, oh, sad. So, then our me was someone ni asabe. So, it don't buy beside or the then. So, all this, uh, you have to think about all what I'm talking, what I'm, what I'm, what I'm telling you, or what I'm informing you here. So, this program will assist you in choosing a good name that brings positive results. And joy to the bearer, so uh, uh, of the name. So, uh, I'm still a mumbo. I'll be a uruko kawati, a you know, ba te ba read a bit about bo. So, why tea and so I want uruko, I want my wani, buba wanka yi. So uh, when Prophet Muhammad was officially appointed uh, as a messenger, as I said, a large number of cities and villages had very bad names and it changed many of, of this city to good names. And he advised parents so, uh, to choose beautiful names so for their children and considered this as one of the rights and obligation that a father must uh, fulfill in respect of his children to give your, your, your child a good name. It's part of, it's one of the responsibility. It's part of your right. The first right your child demanding from you is to name him or her a good name. So with good meaning. So, uh as i said so uh this is very very important uh, issue so uh on this program as i said i will bring some names uh in english you will know uh you know english people also they have uh their way or their custom so naming their children as well so english name uh, Diana, 
So could be a Marcus on it, Diana. That is a judgment. So, uh, Mabia would go kawa in a house, then Ibo. We have, uh, uh, that's Ibo's as well. Just our money, I would go come. So, mashallah, then Fulani's Fulani's anywhere in the world. You know, Fulani, they are everywhere in the world, so they have their way, their customers, well, <clears throat> in naming their child. So, I will explain all this. Then, some, they name their children in Arabic. So, Nitorikbe uh, and Arab people, they have their own way of naming their children as well. Then, African uh, languages, generally. Then, Hebrew. There are some people that all call one, Origin originated from uh, from Hebrew language. Some their name originated from Greek. Some from Irish. Some from French. So then uh, some from uh, Idoma, Igala, Edo, Delta, Efiki, Ibibo. So all this. So I'll come to this. Then 99 names of Allah in Yoruba and English, as I said. So I will bring all those names. 99 names of Allah. Ninuele lumiti mu orukwe. Imidewa that it's not proper for you to name your child. So ninuwa 99 names of Allah. There are some that say, itume koda. Orukola unio, but kokishinto le soma re. Tori Ari, 99 names of Allah. Olo unje adoru. Adoru. Obati nini lara. So, ba uli sili soma reni adoru. So, alimani uwa ambe. Obati ki jaki koshe she. Uwa ambe. Ali kobidu wa obati. Ti mande onamaya. Ti oni jaki. Ikanye kobosi. So, ki she buburu kolon. Pata 99 names of Allah. Kenye ubu elini itume ewa okeo. So, bubu e ni amashala e funwa ni ah uh, bubu ele ita kokonche i ah uh, ah uh, mukodi money. So it's just uh, like ah uh, introduction. So about what ah uh, uh, we are here to 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 to, to discuss. So ah uh, as I said now. Uh, our was okay. It is compulsory for us to name our child, so or it is uh, voluntary or it is uh, recommended. So, uh, there's some controversial issue on this, and some they concluded that it is uh, makiruhu, so it is makiruhu to name uh, our child or uh, to name uh, some they name their children after animal. There are some Arab, Arab, they name their child uh, dog name. So, we are in Kalibu. Ninu awan larubawa Kalibu. Aja ninja beo. Obi oma osone Kalibu. And you now think that, ah, uru kwa ende sound the old fine. Owa soma rebe without knowing the meaning. So, this is very wrong decision. So, uh, but... The the name um, uh, their children uh, after animals that are known for their uh, maybe good qualities or whatever. So Arabs uh, they call their children uh, by such names uh, because it was uh, because of good qualities they notice in them. So some, as I said, they name their uh, child donkey as well, Himar. Himar, ninja donkey, ko bioma ko son, himar, ko an, ah, that name sound very nice. So, to bati bioma ko son, himar, donkey, keta kete ninja beo. So, a bin to li kwe keta kete, o, o, a pesen, o ni suru, la wan sen so, himar, ki o ma wun li ba, ni suru. So, wan de ripi aja, o man protect ya wun ya, la wan sen so, ni kelibu, wan wo, ituma, wan kan wo, quality, ti o wala ra, so uh, this is very 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 wrong so uh, every uh, child as I said so every child is mortgaged uh, with Akika so see 
ama soro lori e ni nigba to ba yabo mi ti setan si mo fe salaye nipa bawo ni kristini bawo na se n so mo loruko ni lana christianity ati lana islam but a a koko fe se lori kini tu mo oruko to fe so ma re so iyen ni o se pataki ju ti an lati koko iyen ju e Uh, someone asked me uh, that he had a, a baby boy on Thursday. So on Thursday at 4 p.m. So when should, uh, should his akiko be? So the name is ceremony when it's going to be. So uh, we shall give details on this. So, But it is compulsory to sacrifice an animal for name is ceremony. So... Uh, what was said about the day of birth uh, not being counted so if uh, the child is born after midday so why so when it so why So, obi o mani mande, se mande lo ma so ma ye lo ruko, joke jo, abi sunday, joke je. So, bo so fin yi kwe, mombo wa lo ri, ele yi. E wari, bo bo a wan, a la e ti, an she yi, o je kanti, o she kwa taki, bo bo, la ta da yi kwe, a le ma, ba wo ni, Uh, a shifè ba ou la shifè she lori uh, a wang mata ba bi a ti ba ou la she le so wani ouru kò eh, ouru kò li si la ri nou bi be li nik pa a ti a wang malayka a wang enje mo se so a uh, wang enje uh, bi uh, sirafu so a wang kerubu so uh, a nel kal kal bu bu e bayi So, owa nou ala eti ama ashe. Eje ka koko lo wo a wan 25 names. 25 names ti owa nino kuran. So, la le yi lo ma mwa wikwe. Oru ko da le ti ni onje koma yikpada. So, oru... Um, ilu kwa kan lo ni da le ti tu mwafin kwe nkan so on lo fe da be ni kwe yato fe wa kufi be fe si yato la ni ya wan kristen ata wan muslim in the area of a wan uru kwa kwa kan ti anso mwa wa la le yi le ma mwa e jeka kwa kwa lo wo ni nu Uh, te ba lo wonu kuran te ba lo wonu kuran uh, kuran uh, kuran 3 verse uh, 59 eri adam ni be kuran 3 verse 59 so you will see the word adam then when you go to the bible check genesis 5 uh Wari Genesis 5. So, wari Adam nibe. Wari Adam nibe. To bade wo Genesis 51 verse 2. Wari Adam nibe. De Ibrahim. Mumba waso to ma Adam wo. I'm still coming to give you the meaning of Adam. But I'm just telling you the source, the sources of all these names we are giving to ourselves, we are giving to our children. We have to know the source first. Then we now discuss the meaning. So that when you have another child, so you will know that you will prefer to, to choose the special name among this name. So... Uh, so when you check um, Quran 19 verse 28, so Omari uh, Haruna, Haruna is in Quran 19 verse 28. Then when you check your Bible, uh, Toba Lawo Exodus, uh, Exodus uh, 7, so uh, verse 1. 
wari uh, Harun ni be uh, then Imran Imran in Arabic so you will see the word Imran is a name given to somebody so Imran Quran 3 uh, verse 3 so uh, ori Imran ni Quran 3 verse 33 Then if you now check Exodus 6 verse 20 you will see Amuran so Amuran Imuran you see so Amuran Imuran so kini ya toto wa nbe so awon arab awon pe ni Imuran awon christian won pe ni Amuran so and i told you christianity came before islam so uh it was about 326 years after uh so that is after three, about 326 years the christianity to spread to all over the world none prophet muhammad was born so then uh, 570 ad prophet muhammad was born that is after several 570 years after the death of jesus so muhammad was born So there is a Bible that was written in Arabic before Muhammad was born. So and then the Bible exists before the Quran. So uh, the Christians they have all these names with them before Prophet Muhammad was born. So now see when you when you open the Bible so Omari Abraham Munibe then when you open the Quran you see Ibrahim what is different nothing no different so abraham is the same as ibrahim so if your name is abraham so you are ibrahim so if you are ibrahim you are abraham so if your name is david so you are daud so if you are daud you are david so now in the in the bible in the quran we find all these names that's i'm trying to 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 inform you about this when you check uh, quran 2 verse 2 251 you will see daud the word daud so and then when you check samuel samuel 17 verse 58 you will see david so david is daud so daud is dauda ohun na tun won pe ni dawod dawodu e d a w o d u ni le yoruba wa ma pe ni dauda bi dawodu so o ma to ba tu je o ma gba ni dile kan to pe won ni first son abi kini o ni dawodu idile yen ni so dawodu iyen itumoto Then awon arab won mi papa julo ni egypt ton ba fe pe daud won daud so won ma ko ni d a w o o d daud so ati daud ati daud d a u d ati d a v i d david so so they are the same so when you check samuel 17 verse 58 so wari david in be when you check quran 2 so verse 251 omari you will see the word daud then sulaiman sulaiman uh, you can see this word this sulaiman in quran 34 verse 14 in the holy quran when you open your bible you will see solomon so ni one king so 10 verse 23 solomon Solomon ati Sulaiman they are the same because they have the same meaning so Abraham and Ibrahim they have the same meaning so uh most important one be meaning so lay okokan but i am just telling you uh the source first then when you check uh Quran 19 verse 49 uh you will see uh, Jacob So Jacob uh is the same as Yakub. So you will see Jacob Quran 19 verse uh, 49. Then when you check uh Quran 
So you will still find this uh, the word Jacob, uh, Yaqub in Quran. Then in, in, in Bible, when you open your Bible, check uh, Genesis 32, verse 1. So you will find Jacob. So Jacob and Yaqub, they are the same. So they have the same meaning. Okay. Then Ismail. So when you go to Quran uh, 38, verse 48, you will see this word Ismail. So Ismail is a name of somebody. So uh, when we have a newborn baby, some they prefer this Ismail. So what is the meaning? I'm coming to that. So then open your Bible, check Genesis 16, verse 11. You will see Ishmael. So Ishmael and Ismaila. So Ismailat, Ismail is the same with Ishmael. So then when you open Quran, you will see the word Ishaq. Ishaq in Quran 19, verse 49. When you open your Bible, Genesis 17, verse 19, you will see uh, Isaac. So Isaac and Ishaq. So they are the same. So then when you go to Quran 19, verse 56, you will see the word Idirizu. Idirizu uh, in Genesis 5, uh, verse 24, Unakbeni Enoku. So that is uh, Idirizu. Then Zakari Yahu, Zakari Yahu, you will see this one in Quran 19, verse 7. So in, Bible, in, in the Bible, when you check Luke, Luke 1, verse 13, you will see Zachariah. So Zachariah and Zakari Yahu, they are the same. Yoruba, sometimes they, 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 they shorten the Zakari Yahu to Saka. Saka? So they think it was, it was a funny name to some people. That is a name of a very great uh, prophet. So Zakariyahu. So Zakariyahu is Zachariah. Now, if you go to Quran 6 verse 36, Ali Yasau. So Ali Yasau, if you check 1 King 19 verse 16, only Elisha. So Elisha is alias alias Ahu. Then if you check Quran 37 verse 123, you will see Ilyasu. Ilyasu in Arabic. So in uh, Biblical uh, term, that is 2 King uh, 1 verse, verse 8. So Ouna uh, ni Ilyasu. So then if you check Quran 3, Verse 59, you will see the word Isa. Isa, uh, only in Matthew 1, verse 16, only Jesus. So, Tebawo, Isa, Isa, Jesus, Jesus, Isa, Erikofe Jorawa, Isa, Jesus. So, that ni. Ain't ever monitor news. Nibati our ni campaign convention can ni a co time can nibati yara dwa to waseko uh PDP at our basanjo. So wa our basanjo one no wa yara dwa so ke colonko ba ke once of because of PDP power. So cause of PDP power. So yara dwa wants of PDP power. So feed if you fawa eh, I will pass on your ready. So oh my god, see power ready. Bed any P I want my casina one ma P P. So fee no ma fi P instead because of P D P power one feed if you fawa. So eh lida yara do a lebi. So because that let you loot one yeah. Emma wo I want my badaba on my lorry me to buy a suki boy. Kuti e jadi rara ku ni lori. Tu fi ka primary school, secondary school, university. Koda ku di professor. Ke eni ko kwe association fo yin. E li kwe association. Ni yon ma wi. Association. E yon yon so yi kwe kwa ma we. So. Da le ti yi lu tan fin soro. O man la kwa la tara. E kata ba fe kwe. 
So, I want to want be a word called Ikale. A day brew or podju, you know. So, I want a brew. A derotic way, I want I want Jew, no bow a Christian called Bibeli Kale. So, a polo bow would call ye, I want Jisha alone, cut out to what Tipati Penny. So, shall we pay? Bible comprises uh, Old Testament and New Testament. A polo bow would call ye. So, I want I want Jew, only Bashan pronounce it. So, uh, then I want Arab. So, oh, what difficult for one lot to pay me? So, be I want Shelly pay. Ni I want pay ye, you ready to go to Shelly, and be I want to answer low lawyer. So, ah, tea, so it to my one, Kako, my boon, and would call it to what? To our anything, ye, sir, no damn Muslim. So, our anything, ye, Ibrahim, no damn Muslim, sadly, Abraham, no damn Christian. So, in your wine, Jay Abraham, you mean it, what Jay Christian, I be Muslim, told you, or to Luru court or lessing. Ambo Abe Uru call or to, essay or to. So, in your con Jay Abraham, Nissin, Kawania, Muslim, Lobo, or Jetting Jay Abraham, Osherare. Ah, Kilaba Jack and Jab do lie. Ah, Muslim, Lobo, or Jet, Osherare, to require Kisha Dada, Kenny, or Jam Muslim, got him a Jab do lie. Prophet Muhammad's father was uh, Abdullah and he was idol worshipper. Uh, he, 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 his mother uh, was named Amina and she was idol worshipper as well. So, our Arab woman saw a woru court on this ship, a low race. What is a woru court? And I be told they keep it from me today. So, only I want Sonny Mohammed. So, pay any tea. I want to pay a cut out back your loan, John alone for our one year. So, I can't do pay your jail, got here when your money eat all my praise. So, what did the Urukon here report? Oro, Tori, Mohammed, or too many tea. I'm a prince. Eric Bobo Bayo, you prince. Oru kwe, oru kati Bobo aye. So oru koma un follow ya, uman tele ya kakiri. So uh, Baba to solo oru ko Baba Baba reni. Tori Baba reti ku when he was Prophet Muhammad's father died when Muhammad was two months in his mother's womb. So he never uh, go tell mo Baba at all. So koma Baba. So his grandfather named him Muhammad. So and that name followed him. So we are coming to that. So uh Jesu Owa Nino Quran. Quran mentioned about Jesus and he narrated the full story about Jesus, how uh, he was born, how he performed the miracles, so how he raised the dead. So Quran mentioned everything. So that is why I want to be okay. So she, Prophet Muhammad, he said copy uh, some of the verses from the Bible because Bible uh, Bible have already uh, narrated some of the stories that Quran also is still uh, narrating to us. So I want to know. Kishiko Prophet Muhammad, Prophet Muhammad never copy the Bible because Bible exists before the Quran. So I will go, ah no, revelation is the same revelations from God through Angel Gabriel, Loamba. So because there are some things Quran mentioned that are re, uh, Bible never mentioned it. But today we are just discussing about the naming, names and the meaning, the source of names, the source where are all these names we are naming our children comes from. So uh then Ayuba. So when you check Quran 6 verse 34, you will see Ayub. So Ayuba, uh, then when you check Job 1 verse 1, so uh, you will see this word Job. Job, Ayub. Actually, Ayub, Job, Eripe, or Then when you check Quran 19 verse 7, you will see the word Yahya. Then this Yahya is John uh, Baptist. So, Niluk 1 verse uh, 13. 
So when somebody's name is John, just know that it's a Yahya. So Lord Amusulumi. Then Yunus. Yunus uh, is in the Quran 37, verse 39. So Yunus is Jonah. Jonah. So and when you check Jonah, Jonah 3, verse 4, you find this Jonah. So then Yusuf. Yusuf, you can you can see uh, Yusuf in Quran uh, uh, Quran uh, six verse uh, eighty four, and then in Quran twelve. So the complete story about Joseph is in Quran twelve, from beginning to the end. So I have narrated the full story of uh, Joseph during the Ramadan. Go and check, check the life story of Joseph in uh, on YouTube. So, uh, so this has been discussed. So Yusuf, in uh, you will see the word Yusuf in Quran six, verse eighty four. Then in uh, Genesis, Genesis twenty, verse twenty four, you will see Joseph. Joseph, Yusuf, Joseph, Yusuf. You see, that's so. They are the same. So. Uh, then, when you check Quran 66, verse 10, you will see the word Lut. Lutuf. So, uh, in Genesis 11, verse 27, Lot. So, Lot, Lut. You will see. So, Tadipe, Ikakanani, Mejeji, Nikpikpe, Potejasape, O Lord, there be one word to come, Okrombe. So, but Kakanani. Then Quran 33, verse uh, 7. So you will see the word Musa. Musa is a great prophet. So when he was alive. So then, if you check Exodus, Exodus 6, verse 20, you will see this word Moses. So Moses uh, is the same as Musa. So, you understand? Then, Noha. Noha, uh, in the Quran, Quran 33, verse 7, you will see this word, Noha. So, some, they add Muhammad. They will now say that Muhammad Nuhu. So, Muhammad Nuhu, na so di mamma nu. So, Abdullah, Muhammad Allah. So he said the Abdullah, one man short it. So Noah uh, in Quran 33 verse 7. Then when you check Genesis 5 verse 29, you will see the word Noah. So in the Bible. So these are the names of the prophets. So uh, as I told you, we have about 124,000 prophets. But Quran mentioned 25. Only 25 mentioned in the Quran. So without telling us the meaning. So you will never see the meaning in the Quran. You just mention the name and continue. So, but I'm um, just giving you this so that you, you have to know the meaning before you can give your, your newborn baby uh, any of uh, these names. So I'm still coming to, to the meaning. Now, if you check Luke, Luke 1, uh, Luke 1, uh, verse 19, so you will see Gabriel. So Gabriel, as I told you, is one of the angels. So I want me, well, there are many people, they name their child Gabriel. So, and then when you check Quran 2, verse 97, you will see Jibril. So Jibril is the same as Gabriel. Then, Quran 19, verse 54, you will see Mikailu. So, Mikailu. And when you check your Bible, uh, Revelation, uh, Revelation 12, verse 17. Oh, sorry, uh, Revelation 12, verse 7, 7. You will see Michael. So, the word Michael and uh, Mikailu are the same. I want to see some people they don't know how to pronounce Mikhail, they now say Mukaila. 
there is nothing like mukaila it's mikailu so in arabic so in uh, biblical uh, terms so me uh, michael so uh then so all the names of uh, jacob's uh, children were not mentioned in the holy quran except yusuf so baoni awon afa you want to, now you want to uh, narrate the 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 full story about joseph now or about the jacob and you want to mention all the children because jacob had about 12 children so quran mentioned just only one so which uh, was yusuf so you have to you need bible so to deliver your lecture so that people will know the names all the 12 names of uh, uh, all the uh, t t yeah 12 names uh, of the children of uh, jacob so you have to mention all the names were mentioned in the bible so i mentioned all this in my uh, previous lecture when i was discussing about the the story of uh, yusuf so you have to open your bible you will see the remaining names of 11 children so but they are 12 in number but quran mentioned just only one Oonikini yusuf so and then quran mentioned uh, about uh, cain and abel so that is habila and qabila so bible also mentioned uh, this now uh, female so quran mentioned about maryam so maryam uh, in fact there is a special chapter for mary the mother of jesus in the quran we have mary chapter surah to maryam we have almighty allah discussed the full story how jesus was born so uh, quran discussed how uh, Maryam was a very great woman, so very obedient, all this and that. So, Maryam is mentioned in Quran 19, verse 34. So, and when you check Matthew, so Matthew 1, verse 16, you will see Mary. So, when your name is Mary, you are Maryam. If you are Maryam, you are Mary. So, it's the same. So, uh, the strange thing uh, in the name, I never see anybody, I never had someone name is a child Pharaoh. And Bible and Quran mention Pharaoh. So, Quran mention Pharaoh in Quran 20 verse 60. So, Pharaoh and Exodus 1 verse 11, Pharaoh. So, Pharaoh and Pharaoh. So, they are the same. So, uh, these are the, uh, the source, uh, the source, or the sources of uh, uh, all these names. So, Lenny, we have many people, Tiwanji Abraham, we have many people, I myself, my name is Dawood or David. So, my parents named me, they named me Dawood. So I'm very happy because the many of Dawood is beloved one. <laughs> I'm so happy. So I'm very fortunate. So uh, Elomi, his name is uh, Adam. So Adam is dust, dust. So dust in the mini Adam. So uh, so now uh, let me quickly. Um, inform me or inform you uh, the meaning so of all this name that I mentioned then maybe we stop and continue uh, next time because this is just introduction so I will rush him ball so Adam uh, Adam is related to Adimula Arid Adimula Arid which, which means uh, dust because God created Adam from what? From dust. That is why Almighty God named him Adam. Because Almighty God sent uh, 
some special angels who are in the department of special duties to fly it down to bring different uh, dust from different places. It's not only one place where they brought the dust. Almighty Allah used to create Adam. So, if your name is Adam, so the meaning of Adam is what? Is dust. So, the dust God used to create uh, Adam. So, uh, then if your name is Idris, Idris is Enoch, as I said. Uh, Idris is somebody that, uh, the first person that used pen to write. So, the first person Almighty uh, Allah taught how to use pen and how to write. So, that is the meaning of Idris. So, Idris. Then, uh, if your name is uh, Hud, so Hudu uh, in Arabic or in Quranic uh, terms, in, in Biblical terms, is Heberu. So, the meaning is skin, skin, so skin, so uh, it's a skin of uh, the body, so of uh, something, so that is the, uh, then Quran 11 uh, mentioned about uh, hood, so in fact the chapter 11 is, uh, is named hood, so in the Quran, then if your name is Salihu, so Salihu so is a uh, Arabic term, so and uh, in uh, Biblical term is a uh, uh, Metusali, so which means uh, good person, so it's from Arabic and also is from Hebrew. So I told you that uh, the Arabic uh, alphabet, most of the Arabic alphabet, they took them from Hebrew alphabet. That is why you will see Alif in Hebrew and you will see in Arabic Alif, Ba, Ta, Sa. So most of them, uh, you see Hebrew language sound like Arabic. So because the Arab people, uh, they took some of the alphabet from Hebrew, they turned it into Arabic alphabet, as uh, Ajay Crowder did. So they took about 25 alphabet from Latin into RBD to write the Bible when they, um, they decided to translate Bible from Arabic to Yoruba. So Ajay Crowder and some uh, John Rabba and some other professors. So they have, because you cannot, it is very, uh, it's not easy for anybody to write uh, any language without the alphabet of that uh, that um, uh, region. So that is why they have to to um, to take some of the Latin alphabet. So to write A B D A F E G B E G K L M N O P R I S T U V. So uh, the uh, the only five left. Tiwa Mu. Or only uh, X. You will never see any Yoruba language start from X. So you will never see any Yoruba language start with V, V, a big Q, a big Z. So to repay one fee, I want to let, but we will look at one jigbe. So you know, Latin to one fee, read Bible, cause Yoruba. Uh, now, I sadly who. O no man kwen sali u sali we ya da da toba je okunrin toba je obirin wo pe ni kini sali ha sole ha e ya da da so good person ni tumo sali u so if you decide to name your child sali u or sali ha so i'm telling you the meaning now that is a, a good person now lots ona ni loot so o ye covering it to me i be veil Kanti awere, ta afin boju, abita afin cover kaka. So, lot originated from Hebrew language. It's Hebrew. So, onak many lots. So, then Ibrahim, 
what is the meaning of Ibrahim or Abraham? So, uh, Abraham is, uh, is an Hebrew, Hebrew language as well, because Abraham was born into Jewish uh, family. So, and you know Jewish, they speak Hebrew language. So, and the, the meaning of Abraham is father of many. So, father of many. So, that is uh, many or, or multitude. So, many to my Abraham. So, uh, Emma, most people that they bear this name, Ibrahim. So, woman, they make it in life. So, old woman, woman, kakiri. Uh, most of them, women who are intelligent, most of Ibrahim, you see them very, very intelligent. And uh, like uh, the first Abraham as well. So he was very, very intelligent, patient, hardworking. So, and then women in the family took war. So the meaning of Abraham is a uh, father of many. So uh, then it's Hak. So Isaac, uh, as I said, is the same as Isaac. So which means he laughs. So so laughter, now it's Isaac. So if you name your child, so Isaac. So I'm just telling you the meaning now. So that that is the uh, meaning of Isaac. Isaac also is a Hebrew. It's an Hebrew language because. If you remember, Isaac uh, is one of the children of Abraham. Abraham had eight children in life. So, uh, and then, you know, as I uh, he had Ishmael first before Isaac. But Bible said he had Isaac before Ishmael. But we are not here to discuss that. So we are here just to give the meaning. So Isaac is laughter because Sarah was very happy when she conceived after she had lost um, um, uh, faith. So and Opada Loyun. So that is why they name uh, that boy uh, Isaac. So this name is for boy, not for women, not for female. So. Um, so that is the meaning. Then Jacobu, Jacobu, that is uh, Jacob. So uh, Jacob, uh, we uh, we had uh, many, uh, um, or we uh, we had many controversial issue on Jacob. So I have said this several times about Jacob. Uh, what happened between him and Esau, so his brother. So, you know, Jacob and Esau, they are the children of Isaac. Isaac, the son of Abraham. So, and Jacob wrestled with God and forced God to bless him. So, uh, God gave Jacob, so the new name as Israel. They changed his name to Israel. So somebody that wrestled uh, with God, so and forced God to bless him. That is the meaning of Jacob. But I ask myself. But before that story happened, so he was already named Jacob. So, uh, so because of what happened, he changed his name to Israel. So today. So Jacob is the father of Israelites because he had 12 children. So that 12, 12 children, they regard them as uh, uh, Israelite, the children of Israel. That is the children of Jacob. So another name for Jacob is Israel. So we have some people that they name their child Israel and some Jacob. So that is the meaning of your name. Uh, Yusuf. That is uh, Joseph. So, uh, Joseph means uh, increase. Uh, increase. King Kokuma Kosi. To add more to something. <clears throat> increase. King Kokuma Kosi. That is the meaning of uh, Yusuf or Joseph. So, so they are the same. 
Then if your name is uh, Shuaib, Shuaib is uh, Jethro. So uh, Shuaib uh, is uh, somebody who show the right path, the right way. Somebody who is showing you the right way all the time when you are about to get astray. So, Shuaibu. So, ni uh ni owo sale awon to ba nje shuaibu mo pe saibu so saibu ati shuaibu so so it is the same so that is the meaning then if your name is ayub that is job so ayuba or job so means uh to to repent so to repent so somebody who ask for forgiveness of Almighty God all the, all the time. So that is the meaning of uh, uh, Job. Because of uh, Ayuba. If your name is uh, Sulikifuli, that is Isikeli. In the Bible, uh, in biblical term, Isikeli is Sulikifuli. So Sulikifuli uh, means a professor. Uh, professor of the fold, so to turn something over, so to bend something, to bend it, that is the meaning of uh, suliki fully. Uh, so we have to think about all this name before we give our child. So as I'm giving you the meaning now, so the choice is yours. Musa, Musa, Moses. So, what is the meaning of Musa or Moses? Musa is a, is 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 a, is an Hebrew Hebrew language. Although he was born in Egypt, you know Egypt is uh, is an is an is uh, Arabic country or Islamic state because Egypt they speak Arabic even before Islam came up to them. I told you, Arabic has nothing to do with Islam. They have been speaking Islam before Prophet Muhammad was born. So they have been speaking Arabic before Prophet Muhammad was born. So Arabic has nothing to do with religion. But uh, Islam came with Arabic because Prophet Muhammad could not speak any other language than Arabic. That is why Quran was written in Arabic because you could not speak any other language. So Mose, so originally derived from uh, Egyptian, so uh, which means son. So Mose means son, son. Uh, and this Mose was a very great uh, prophet. So because he led the Israelites uh, out of uh, Egypt. So to the promised land, because they enslaved Israelites, so for about four hundred and fifty years by Pharaoh, and uh, it was Prophet Moses that was sent to help the Israelites out of Egypt. So Moses is given the title uh, uh, to to talk to Almighty God direct. So, so that is uh, Moses has a, a special nickname that is Kelimullah in Arabic. Kelimullah Quran says, Wakallam Allah Musa Tekiliman. So, Moses spoke to Almighty God direct without any angel. So, so the meaning of Moses means son. Some say someone uh, because you know Moses was put in a box and the river carried him to the back yard of uh, Pharaoh's palace and then so a, a child I found in the river so some say this is the meaning of Moses. And then Musa and Arab woman play clipper, kind of in Geru, woman play ni Musa, so as well. So, uh, then Haruna, 
So Harun, uh, what is the meaning of Harun? This is Harun is a uh, uh, heron. So uh, it's uh, it's an Hebrew Hebrew language as well. Uh, Harun is mentioned about twenty times in the Holy Quran. So Harun was the brother of Prophet uh, Musa. The meaning of Harun is what? Mountain. Mountain, mountain, okay, okay, la la. So now you have a newborn baby and you name him Haruna. So this is the meaning. So the choice is yours. Uh, this name dedicated uh, just for the male child, not female. So uh, now let us move to David. So as I said, David is the same as Dawood. So David means beloved one. So I'm so happy this is the meaning of my name. So David is the same as Dawood, as I said. So, uh, and he was a king. So when he was alive, so... Uh, so, uh, is uh, the origin of this name related to Hebrew, as I said. So, David is not an Arabic word. It is not an Irish word. It is not a Yoruba word. It's not an Hausa. It's not an Igbo. So, originally, the word is Hebrew. So, so is uh, an Hebrew language. As I said, so most of uh, children in Africa, they name their children foreign name. So, foreign. So my name is foreign in in my country. So and some they name their children local name. Be Odewale, Anyewale, Kewbemi, Ishola. So in Yoruba. So, but David is uh, an Hebrew language. So, which was derived from Hebrew. Uh, originally, it, uh, it was called Dodu. Dodu. So, Dodu means uh, beloved or uncle. Or uncle. So, Dawood was uh, second and greatest of the kings of Israel, who ruled in the uh, about 10th century. So, 10th century BC. So, King David defeated Goliath. So this story is mentioned in the Bible and in the Quran. The Quran said Dawood uh, um, uh, killed uh, Goliath or it defeated him So during the war. So uh, the spelling of uh, David, as I said, is D-A-V-I-D but Dawood, some, some the, the right the spelling as D A U D A. Some they write it as D A W uh, O D. The wood. So some they write it as Dawood. Uh, D A W O D U or D A U D U. So so that is the meaning of the the wood or David. Uh, then Elias. Elias. Uh, Elias uh, means Allah is my God. So Allah is my God. Our God is my God. So it is a uh, borrowing name from Greek. So originally it is from Greek. So the word Elias. So and then this Elias. Uh, then uh, Jehovah is God. That is the meaning. That is the meaning in the Bible. The Bible gave us the meaning of Elias. Elias means Jehovah is God. So some says it derives from the Hebrew language. Originally is Eliyahu. So Eliyahu. So means my God is the Lord. God sent him to the northern kingdom of Israel. So during the reign of Ahab, the king of Ahab. 
uh, iti ajaje, ajaje uh, so in the 9th century BC. So then it is. So if your name is Idris, so what is the meaning of Idris? So Idris, as I said, is somebody that uh, God taught how to write or interpreter. Somebody who interprets so from one language to other. That is the meaning of uh, Idris. So Idris was the first person to write with pen. So, Quran mentioned about pen in Quran 96, verse 4 to 5. So, he said he taught, he taught man to use pen and taught him how to write. Solomon. So, what is the meaning of Solomon or Suleiman? So, the meaning of Solomon or Suleiman is peace. So if you your name is Suleiman, you have to be a peace ambassador anywhere you are in the world. If you are a Suleiman, you have to keep peace to reign. If you are a violent person and your name is Suleiman, it means your parents gave you wrong name. So Suleiman means peace. So peace. Uh, Solomon, so was the son, son of uh, King David. Uh, and he was blessed with wealth, wisdom. So, and he has many wives, over 700. So, King Solomon derived from Hebrew, uh, from Hebrew language, Shalom. So, it's from Shalom, uh, they derived Solomon, means peace. So, and in Arabic as well, so means peace because when Arab says Selima Yeslamu, so it means Salamatan, so that is peace. Salamun Kaula Miro Birahim, peace from Almighty Lord to you. So, Salamun. And uh, the, the way of greeting of Muslims within themselves, within themselves, is, uh, they will say, Assalamu Alaikum. So, peace be upon you. That is the meaning of salam aleika. If you are a man, if it's a woman, they will say salam aleiki. So, uh, if there are many, they will say salam aleikum. The meaning of salam is peace. So, salam, Sulaiman was derived from salam, the word salam, salima yaslam. So, Sulaiman uh, or salman. So, means peace. Salman and Solomon. So, they are the same. Then Ali Yasa'u. So, Ali Yasa'u is a great, it is a, uh, it's a great name as well. Originally from Greek. The word meaning, the meaning of uh, Ali Yasa'u is the noble one. The noble one. So, uh, somebody with a very good uh, character. So some says it is a name of a flower, a flower in Greek. There is a flower in, in Greek called Ali Yasau. It's a very, very beautiful flower. So that is the meaning of Ali Yasau. If your name is Ali Yasau, it means your name is a name of flower, a very beautiful flower. So if you are happy with that. So Yunus. So Yunus means dove. Eje. So if your name is Yunusa, Yunusa, Yunus is the same. So the meaning is what? Dove. So it is derived from the Hebrew as well. It's from Hebrew language. So Yunus is Jonah. So the meaning of Jonah is dove. So the meaning of Yunus is dove. So uh, and some say that dove means a uh, peaceful person, so or gift from God, so a gift, a special gift from God. So that is the meaning of Jonah or Yunus. Zakariahu. So Zakariahu, uh, as I said, so or Zakariah. So, uh, the meaning of uh, Zakariyahu 
means the Lord has remembered us. So it is derived as well from Hebrew language. So uh, it is from Hebrew. Quran mentioned uh, Zachariah in Quran 19. Uh, and the male given name is uh, this. That is, this name is dedicated for male only. So, uh, you know, um, Zachariah uh, was a husband of uh, uh, Hannah. And also, you know, Imran, the father of Mary, the mother of Jesus. So, and this Zachariah had a son called John. That is Yahya. So, John baptized Jesus. So, and then, uh, you know, Zachariah had a, a son called Yahya. That is John. And he was murdered. So, by a King Herod. So, so the meaning of Yahya, Yahya, uh, Yahya means uh, women. So in ancient Greek, so the meaning of Yahya is women. So in what in ancient uh, Greek, that is in the old language of Greek, Yahya means uh, women, and this Yahya uh, was murdered because. The king Herod requested uh, to marry a, a beautiful lady, and the lady rejected him. He refused. He now puts the uh, the king on condition. He told the king that if the king can bring the head of Yahya, that is John, he will agree to marry to marry him, and the king agreed. So he now sent some of his. Um, uh, people working with him, some boys, to go and bring the head of Yahya. So after they brought the head, so to him, so the king now sent the head of uh, John to the lady. So the lady died instantly. So and then you know, so his father had him in old age. So Zachariah was not happy when the news reached him. So he rushed quickly to the palace and he argued with the king. So then the king asked his, uh, his security as well so to run after Zachariah as well, to kill him as well. So, so he was beheaded. And also that is how Almighty God destroyed the whole city because of what... Uh, the, the, the great sin they committed. So, uh, the, so Yahya means women. So, uh, then uh, I think also they said that uh, it's from Hebrew language, as I said. Some say the meaning of Yahya is Yahweh. So, Yahweh so, uh, is uh, uh, gracious. So, uh, that is uh, uh, the meaning. So, the originally, yo, so the turn into Yahya means uh, God, means God, so in Hebrew. Uh, then uh, he baptized Jesus, as I said, and he was murdered by King Herod. So, uh, in Arabic, some say Yahya is from a word called um, a, a verb Hayya Yahya Hayatan. So that is uh, that is he survived. So, but Yahya never survived, and his father prayed for about seven days, requested for this boy from uh, God. Because when, he was, when his wife was barren, so he was not happy. So, and God promised that he's going to give him a, uh, a good, long-life child. So, what is sudden that he died at the age of 17. So, may Almighty God uh, grant their soul eternal peace. So, now to Jesus. So, Isa. So what is the meaning of Jesus? So the word Isa 
uh, as I say, Isa is Jesus. So most people, they translated Jesus' name to uh, Joshua. So originally, you know, Jesus was born into a uh, into Jewish family, and then they speak Hebrew language. That is why they are the people, they help the, the Christian to translate the Bible from Hebrew language. The first Bible was written in Hebrew language. So, and later, they helped them to translate it into Greek, then from Greek to Latin, before the British helped them to translate it into uh, English. So, the word Jesus, uh, most people translated Jesus' name to Joshua. So, Joshua is the same as Jesus. So, many God is salvation. So, some says Jesus means Savior. So, that is why some of, most of the Christians, they say Jesus is my Savior. Jesus is my Lord. So, the meaning of Jesus means Savior. So, Olubanila. And uh, it is derived, so, from Greek. So, from Greek as Yeshua. So, Yeshua. So that is the original uh, where the name derived from. So Hebrew, uh, in Hebrew, is Yeshua. So many, some say, is rescue or save. So Jesus came to uh, to be called. So he became hmm, to be called Jesus, Jesus Christ. So many, the meaning of Jesus Christ is uh, Jesus the Christos. So, the Christos, that is, they change the Christos to, to, to Christ. So, Jesus the Messiah. So, or Jesus the Anointed One. So, after his, so after his death, so, they called him Jesus Christ. So Christ uh, is the, is a title. So Christ is a title of Jesus. So from Greek word, as I said, Christos. So Christos means the anointed uh, person. So Islamically is so known as Isa. So Isa and Jesus. So they are the same. Isa, Jesus. So it's the same. Look for my book. So, there is a book I published last year titled Jesus and the Virgin Birth. So, it's about 198 pages. So, the book is full of information about Jesus. So, uh, this is the meaning of uh, Jesus. So, now come to Muhammad. So, Prophet Muhammad, now I'm giving you the names of uh, the prophets mentioned in the Bible and mentioned in the Quran. So now I'm giving you the meaning because most of the people when they, uh, when they have a new born baby, so they will check so the list of the names of the prophets or from other source to name their child. So I'm just giving the meaning now so that you know uh, what to do. So now Prophet Muhammad was the last prophet. So because he came after about 570 years after Jesus. So Jesus was born into Jewish um, family as I said and Muhammad was born in deserts, so within the Quraysh. So the family of Quraysh, uh, they, they are very powerful people uh, in, uh, in, in, in uh, Ijaz. So, and there is uh, a guy called uh, Abdul Muttalib. So this Abdul Muttalib, so 
uh, he had about uh, 10 children. So he had about 10, ten uh, children. So among his children, uh, his, uh, one is uh, Abdullah. So then he had uh, Hamza. Hamza. So Hamza so is one of uh, his children. Then he have uh, Abbas. Then he have Abu Talibi. So he have uh, Abu Lahab. He have uh, uh, he had uh, Zubair. So he had Dirar. He had uh, Gaidaku. So he had Mukawim. He had uh, Haris. So this Haris so is the Eda um, son. So among his children. So wa as Garuhum. So ito kereju ni no one to je lasbo on Abdullah. So and this Abdullah was the father of Prophet Muhammad. So now uh, as I said, so Abdullah was not a Muslim, the father of Prophet Muhammad. So all these names, all those people I mentioned, they are idol worshippers. So nobody can uh, oppose this. So they are either either worshippers. So it was after Prophet Muhammad was born, as I said, Prophet Muhammad's father Abdullah so died when Muhammad was two months in his mother's womb. So when uh, Amina, his mother was Amina, this Amina also was not a Muslim. So she was an idol worshipper because in Mecca they believe in idols and they have 365 idols. So they worship one idol per day before Prophet Muhammad was born. So when Muhammad was born, so it was his grandfather, Abdul Muttalib. So as I said, Abdul Muttalib was the father of Abdullah. So his grandfather was Abdul Muttalib. So it was Abdul Muttalib that named him Muhammad. So Muhammad means uh, praised one or thanked one. And it is a dukwekwe alone for because Abdullah, his father, died so as a um, uh, younger age. So he, uh, he never had any other children than Prophet Muhammad. So Prophet Muhammad so was named Muhammad. So don't think that his father, because he, he was named Abdullah, that you will now think that he was a Muslim. No, there's nothing, nothing like Islam in Mecca that time. So it was Prophet Muhammad that introduced Islam to them. So that is why they attempted to kill him. They attempted to murder him. So, and he left Mecca at the age of 57, 54. And he moved to Medina. So that Medina, the city belongs to the Christian and the Jewish people. So they are the ones that helped him. They accommodated him. They gave him house, many things. So including his followers. Because they left Mecca to save uh, their life. So and the religion, new religion they introduced to them in Mecca. So... So when he, he arrived in Medina, so he met many Christians and Jews. So that is why, as I told you, when he started preaching and mentioned names, Abraham, Adam, in his Quran, he now said, ah, so you have this, we have it as well in our book. So that Ibrahim in your Quran is Abraham in our Bible. That's your Suleiman is Solomon in our Bible. That's your Dawood is David. So the Bible is sixth. Bible is sixth before the Quran, as I said. So 
Now, so Muhammad means depressed one. So, and you will see that Prophet Muhammad was uh, praised as well, even after he died. So, Prophet Muhammad he, he was a great prophet. So, like others, Jesus, Moses, so all of them. So, Muhammad, the word Muhammad comes from the passive participle of the Arabic verb. Uh, from Hamada. So Hamada means he praised him. So Yohamidu, he will praise him. So Tahamidan, so praising. So Muhammadu, the person that praised someone. Muhammadu, somebody that we are praising. So that is how the word Muhammad uh, came up. So, and as I said, they named him Muhammad. So, but the Bible mentioned about uh, that there is a great prophet that will be born in uh, uh, deserts. So, in Deuteronomy 18, you will see that uh, another great uh, prophet will be. Uh, Raised among them all this, and I have mentioned this in other um, of my lectures. So, and now, after, uh, so he was living among the idol worshiper till age of, uh, because uh, his grandfather also died when he was eight. So he lost his mother again. At the age of six, so Prophet Muhammad was an orphan. So he lost his father when he was two months. When his father was two months, uh, when he was two months in his mother's womb, he lost his father. So when after he was born, so uh, his mother uh, took care of him till age six. So his mother died. Then his grandfather Abdul Muttalib took care of him for two years. He died. So he now moved to his uncle's house. That is Abu Talib. So he was living in Abu Talib's house till the age of 25. So he was uh, working as steward. So steward. So like Kisha Omod or Lord of Khadija. Khadija was a great woman, very wealthy woman. And Prophet Muhammad, uh, Abu Talib took Muhammad to her so that she... So that Muhammad will have something as Smith or something like that. So uh, in the end, Khadija loved him, and he proposed. He proposed ma in marriage that uh, he. Uh, so he loved Muhammad, and he proposed marriage. And then, so Khadija was forty years old. Prophet Muhammad was twenty-five. So, and they married. So, and Prophet Muhammad had about seven children in his life. So, this Khadija had uh, six. So, for him, for Prophet Muhammad. So, Prophet Muhammad uh, had seven children, as I said. So, Khadija uh, had uh, about uh, six for, for him. So, uh, and then... Another woman had another boy for him, so Prophet Muhammad had seven uh, children. So, and after uh, the, rev the revolution started or began when he was 40 years old, and then the, the revolution came for about 23 years. So, so the compilation of the Quran began after he died. So Quran contained about 214 chapters. So uh, before he died, so he named himself some other names apart from the name that was given to him. So Prophet Muhammad had about 201 names. 201 names. So among these names, there are some Muslims. They name their uh, children. So from those names, 
so which we shall discuss. So, but before that, Prophet Muhammad had uh, seven children, as I as I said. So he had Qasim. Qasim is one of the uh, Prophet Muhammad's uh, name, and Qasim originally is from Hebrew, so or Arabic. Qasim means divider. That's the meaning of Qasim. So if your name is Qasim, the meaning is divider. So if you want to be dividing things, that just know that that is the, your name. So so Qasim is one of Prophet Muhammad's children. So Prophet Muhammad named um, one of his children Zainab. Zainab meaning beautiful, beautiful flower. So a beautiful tree. Igi Torewa, Ninja Zainabu. So then he had Rukaya. Rukaya means rise up. So rise up. So uh, then he had Umu Kulisum. So mother of Kulisum. Kulisum means one who has fully healthy. So or somebody that has beautiful cheek. And to like to find So umu means ya. So the mother of kul. So the mother of beautiful chick. That is the meaning of umu kulisum. Then Prophet Muhammad named one of children Abdullah because, as I said, he lost his father when he was two months. Uh, two months in his mother's womb. So one of uh, his children named Abdullah. What's the meaning of Abdullah, servant of God? So he named uh, one of her children Fatima. So now Fatima, some people they 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 prefer to call Fatima Bintu Rasulullah, so the daughter of uh, Prophet. So now when you hear Binta, when somebody's name is Binta, just know that the meaning of Binta means daughter. So Fatima, so is the daughter of Prophet Muhammad. So people mostly call her Fatima to be to Rasulullah. So been to Rasulullah, been to Rasulullah. So Oma Ujishi alone. So and what is the meaning of Fatima? Is uh, captivating. So captivating. That is the meaning of Fatima. Then he named one of her children Ibrahim. So Ibrahim, as I told you, is father of many. Why Ibrahim? Because Prophet Muhammad, as I told you, was grand, 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 grand son of Abraham. Abraham had Isaac and Ishmael, as I told you. So from lineage of Ishmael, so that was where the Abdul Muttalib, the grandfather of Prophet Muhammad, came up. So from Ishmael to Abdullah, the father of Prophet Muhammad, we have about 27 fathers. So he, he knew this story that he, he is, his generation so were from this uh, Ibrahim, Abraham. Because you know, Hajara, the, the mother of Ishmael, uh, was moved from Iraq. Hijaz. So Hajara, the mother of uh, Ishmael, took uh, Abraham took her to a desert. So Ishmael was born in uh, Arab land. So the tribe of uh, Jurihumu, they are the people that they taught Ishmael Arabic. Ishmael was speaking Hebrew language because he was not an Arab man. So Ishmael was living there. So his mother was Egyptian. Egyptian, you know, Hajara. Abraham married Hajara ha or Hagar in Egypt. So he was a slave given to, uh, she was a slave given to him. So, and then there was a controversial issue between her and uh, Sarah, the first wife. So that is why she left the house in Iraq and moved to Hijaz. So Ismail was born there. So Ismaila was the great-great father of Prophet Muhammad. 
So, uh, Brother Muhammad now named one of uh, his children Ibrahim in remembrance of his great great father. So, that is why you see that some people as well they name their children. So, maybe grandfather or their, their father. So, Ibrahim, I've told you, the father of many. So, Brother Muhammad had seven children three boys and four girls. So, Kosim, Zainab, Rukayat, Umukulisum, Abdullah, Fatima, Ibrahim. So, uh, and the Fatima in the Bible, so we found by Fatima in the Bible, they will say Our Lady of Fatima. So, European, Portuguese, there is a lady like that, so known as uh, Our Lady of Holy Rosary uh, of Fatima. So, so she's Brazilian, so Portuguese, so Catholic title of the Blessed Virgin Mary, all this and that. So Fatima, so the meaning of Fatima, so one who wins an infant, so that is one who abstains not, and to jale noya. So Fatima Sahara, the shining one. So the meaning of Fatima is different in several languages. So these are the children of Prophet uh, Muhammad and the meaning. So some Muslims, they take the name from the children of Prophet Muhammad. We have many Rukaya in, in the north. We have many Miriam, Fatima. So... These are the meaning. So, Prophet Muhammad had about 11 wives. So, 11 wives of Prophet Muhammad. So, the first wife was Khadija. Then, he married Saudat. So, Saudat means uh, black. So, black. So, Khadija, uh, she supported Prophet Muhammad. And the meaning of Khadija is uh, premature premature baby. <laughs> so that is the meaning of Khadija. So I have to tell you the truth. Premature baby. That's the meaning of Khadija. If you want to name your female child Khadija, so that is the meaning. So he married Sauda. Sauda means black. So and then he married Aisha. So Aisha was the daughter of Abu Bakr. So so uh, she's credited um, with uh, narrating more than 2,000 hadiths. So the meaning of Aisha is who lives, uh, so who lives, so, or somebody who is alive. So that is the meaning of Aisha. Anything Gai Abentin Shemi, that's the meaning of Aisha. Then he married Hafsa. Afusa was the daughter of uh, um, of uh, Prophet Muhammad. So, and then also, ah, sorry, uh, was the daughter of uh, this uh, one of the uh, companion uh, called uh, Umar. So Afusa also has uh, about multiple meaning. So Afusa means a female lion cub. So how much can it be? Nani tuma hafusa, iwoto banji hafusa, that is the meaning. So little lion. So that is the meaning of uh, hafusa. So and uh, in uh, swile uh, meaning, it means God judgment. So in Arabic, it means gathering. So King Kanko Kokojo. So uh, so these are the uh, some of the wife of Prophet Muhammad. Prophet Muhammad number five also married Zainab. I've told you the meaning of Zainab. So he married uh, Ummu Salama. Ummu Salama means mother of peace. So he married Jueria. The meaning of Jueria, when Jue. To jump up, okay, and force, okay. So he married another lady called Zainab as well. So he had more than one Zainab. Then he married Umu Habiba, the mother of beloved one. 
So that is uh, that one was the daughter of uh, Abu Sufyan, so a strong leader of Quraysh who attacked Prophet Muhammad. So then he married uh, Safiya. Safiya, she was captured as a slave and freed. So and Prophet Muhammad married her. So and the meaning of Safiya is pleasant, something very clean. So then he married Memuna. That is number eleven. Memuna means a uh, blessing. So a fortune. That is the meaning of Memuna. Now we Memuna, Memuna. So uh, ituma uh, uru koyeniye. So uh, his mother, as I said, Prophet Muhammad's mother was Amina, and the Amina means trustworthy. You see trustworthy so the meaning if the meaning is very positive so there's nothing wrong so to name our child so uh this and then uh so mariam so mariam uh you know the mother of jesus so was a very great woman so uh it has different meaning so Miriam in French and in Hebrew in Latin so carries different meaning. So but Miriam means bitterness. <clears throat> so uh, as uh, I said, so uh, so after Prophet Muhammad, so when he started the revelation, he now named himself different different name as I said. So some after he died, they named him different names prophet muhammad they name him muhammad hamadu hamidu mahamudu kosimu akibu fatihu shahidun uh hashiru shahidu mashihud now okay you can't get mashihud in this mashihud so it's one of prophet muhammad's name mashihud bashiru so bashiru so uh then nadiru Dai, Shafin, Hadi, so Rasulun, so Nabiun, Wumiun, so Tihamiun, so Hashimiun, so Abtohiun, Azizun, so Rukoye Opo, so which we cannot complete this uh, today. Uh, but there are some names that they named Prophet Muhammad, which was um challenge so some people we call them salafi the challenge people who call prophet muhammad nasiru the meaning of nasiru is helper they said how could you use this name to qualify muhammad prophet muhammad cannot help anybody it's only god that we can call nasiru and they challenge them back that prophet muhammad helped the people of mecca so from darkness to light so because he brought islam to them today all of them so they have converted to uh, islam so now with the grace of islam see Makkah today saudi arabia they are the richest nation in the world today so uh, and they have spent billions of dollars on quran and spread islam so, and uh, some say it's because of Prophet Muhammad that brought Islam to them. So, some say that, uh, so Muhammad, if they call him Nasiru. So, uh, some say that why they call Muhammad Shafi'u. So, Shafi'u is an uh, intercessor. So, somebody who can intercess within God and someone. And some, they call Muhammad Sayyidul Kaunaini the leader of the heaven and earth. <laughs> so now that said, if you call Muhammad uh, the leader of heaven and earth, what about Adam that came before him? What about Jesus that came before him? What about Abraham? So these are the things that uh, we shall discuss uh, next time. So um, by grace of God, after this day, I will now move into the 99 names of God. Where we start, then so then we continue. So, this is where we stop today. So, uh, thank you for your wonderful, precious time to watch this program and listen to us. So, may Almighty God continue to 
be with us and uh, just think about what we have discussed for today and then we have mentioned some names um, as i told you i have more than 4000 names that we need to discuss the many so for the future generation if there are some people they don't think about this we today that this is a, a era of technology era of knowledge so we have to uh, educate ourselves and also review what are the uh, the authors in the past what they left behind we have to review them and ask ourselves so why this why that so that uh, the the future uh, uh, the future, the generation in future, we we pray for us, and they will be happy uh, with what we are uh, we are reviewing. So because we have to review. So as I said, if you go to Yoruba land today, most of them, particularly in Ilefe, if you ask them to tell you the story of uh, Yoruba, some still believe that God sent an, an human being from heaven. To add, is that possible? So, no. So, along with Jue, the Kakalati Summer, so some they believe Odudua, he came from heaven, from summer with uh, with his wife, Oma <laughs> Lokun. That, but one had a daily, one had a kill, one had a kill, one had a kill. So, these are the uh, some some uh, okay so there are some stories someone just cook it uh reference Samuel john c also author a book the history of yorubas i read that book from beginning to the end so there are many uh many um uh, challenges or uh, some i want to cook because when he was narrating the story of Ilori, he said in that book that uh, it was uh, uh, Sheikh Alimi that killed Afanja because he wanted to establish Islam. That is very wrong. Islam already flourishing. Uh, flourishing. Islam was already spread in Ilori before Sheikh Alimi came to Ilori more than 100 years. And it was not Sheikh Halimi that killed Afanja. No. So it was one of his children that killed Afanja. So there are many things that we need to to rewrite, to put in the buy in the library so that the generation we we have the the facts. So because most of them want she investigation. So uh, investigation so that we have the right record and the, the right story. So all this Bible Quran we are talking about now, you know, I want to I want to want call so not the law. So and they left Bible and Quran. So for us, so now uh, now we we are now asking ourselves that okay. So in a conje Abraham, so in a conje Noah, so or Tony, I want you know to be one or to look at one so on. So okay, star and a banjo coy Lenny, Jank or come wrong in bed. So okay, I'll come up. Okay, I know, but would you look at your uncle Colony or cot woman? So I mean, you know, so uh, listen. So by Jeshegun, Taba Fe translates the Shegun in Arabic and Galibu. So, to by Jeshegun, on Je Galibu. So, to by Je, um, uh, about Je Victor. So, Galibu. In your conje blessing is, your name is blessing. In Arabic, it means you are, uh, Rahima. To by Jobiri, female Rahima, to by Jokuni. Eh, Rahim, ono kwe ni Rahimi. So, eh, Abi Rahman, anuna ni jebe blessing ni. So, now, si dadani ki oji Arabi ki ye, Abi Ali, 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 change ka kwe ni ye. Kini isa, ki muslimi ka kolo unje blessing. So, kwa ni kilo, kwa ni blessing, ah, abo ya we blessing bo. 
Christian in no matter for consequent your blessing. That is very wrong thought. And Uru come and tell you, man tell you, Uru share go back on your chief, Uru share go back on your when he was early, in fact, one thing, one more day, he asked about you, early, Uru come and tell you, Baba. So, Oku le wan, o the president. So shegun, olu shegun, oba, sanjo, olu koyen, follow wan, un follow wan. So be na wala wan, mi be 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 be. So, nkato mo fe lo, niko olu koma anro yan. E o Jonathan. Good luck, Jonathan. So you see, this follow, this is name followed him. He became uh, deputy governor in Baeza. From deputy governor to governor. From governor to vice president. From vice president to President, because good luck, and Jonathan uh, gifts you know in the court of the So all command telling you. So you have to think very very well before you name your child, because the mini follows the bearer. So ah 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 ni so Dubai lo ni alayi awati awa ina ni atu padawa lagbarolong. Uh, can review it. Can I share it? Can I send the comments? So, all of the Kalobati Okwetan. This is where we stop our program for today. Inshallah, we shall continue. Uh, maybe uh, next week. So, so that I will give time for you to digest uh, this that we have discussed so far. So you have right as well to make your research if anything that I said. So we bear call, but uh Kato Dawa Lu Juni and Soropelu uh in Wabai Matiolon Fu Awana just to educate ourselves ki Ali Ma Kakanti Oye Kiama. So I won't come out to compile a wool coca and bo abe. So we put on by be your money your Monday. So once of my pay okay. Jo le be ma a jo monday ni awa fati day. So awa fine ye wawa lo wo awa tira kata wa kati ko jo kwe any to ba bini or jo monday so to ba je o kone uh to ekwe no uru kolo ni eje ka soni abdili wahidi. So abika soni jami u. Abi ka so ni Shakuru. To ekwe no ruka wa nebi olo on lo ba fe. Eje ka so ni Muhammad. Abi ka so ni Ibrahim. Abi ka so ni Yakub. Uwa lo ubu. Uwa to banja wa ruko yi. O jomande ni wwa biyo. So to rikpe jomande. Awa kawa to ti tuwa wa ruko yi. Ele u la wa fa man lo ye wu. To wo fi wa so. Awa ma yini. O ruko. To ba jekpe o bere ni. To ba jekpe jomande wa ni koma jekha fusa. Abi Aisha. So. Abi ha wawu. So, to ba yon yon Tuesday ni, no a wun ru kwa wawu, ane bi yon lom, ten ni ebe ti sopke nou ru kwa wawu, ane bi yon lom lo wunfe, wawu lo ye wu ipe, oh, no a wawu ane bi yon lom, yon Tuesday oda, wawu ri isi aka, da wuda, to wato ba yon da wuda isi, abi Suleiman, abi isi hak, abi Yakub, abi Yusuf, abi Musa, abi Haruna, so, abi Hudu, so, o yon Tuesday ni wawu bi yon, so, to ba yon kwenye awuru kwa wano, awuru kwa lwa wano ni wafè mu, ni nwe. So, wani koma jen Abdul Gani, abi koma jen Baki, so, abi koma jen Abdul Somad. So, awan kena to awuru kwa yi, kale. So, wati toto kouni, wati toto beni, fun wa jok kankan, ni Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So, now, she da 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 ni ka follow, i katou wakbe kale yi, so, eni to ba fo le, se o di de le she, a bo da be. So, a bo wa be. So, la gba yon long. So, o long wa wak pe lwen. God bless you all. Bye. Thank you. Thanks for watching.